Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Yusef Scott and I thank each and every one of you for being here with me this morning. I thank all of you who've been supporting me over the years. Uh, those of you who are subscribed, newly subscribed, or just support me and my efforts to put out information uh, to the world. I thank you so much. Um, I just wanted to put out a, you know, a little recap of the three trade alerts that I put out last week on the 27th of um, of uh, July and I put out three trade alerts on a USD CAD on a Euro USD as well as the Australian dollar NZD alright I'm gonna go over those three trades right now um, I thought it would be great that I did that because I received um, a number of emails uh, from people all over the world thanking me for those three trade alerts um, you know while I was on vacation just getting back definitely 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 appreciate the welcome um, for those of you who uh, actually knew that I was on vacation for a few days but I wanted to just make sure you guys understood what was going on so on the 27th I went over th this is the Euro USD daily and I went over the Euro USD as you see on the 27th it was a um, it closed out bullish but even since then it, it has moved up quite considerably you're talking right now maybe a little over or just about 150 pips which is great all right and uh, and you know that's that's a great thing so most of you are probably deep in profit and it's it's looking very good so um, you know that's that's that was a great trade um, you're looking at the USD CAD if you notice on the 27th we were it actually closed out uh, bullish but however we were looking at um, the market going down, of course, and since then it, it actually traveled down just about 100 and roughly 150 pips as well. So that was another great opportunity. Okay. Then finally, the Australian dollar, New Zealand dollar, if you notice on the 27th, we were actually closed out bearish and let's just say the market went down from there and right now we're looking at 50 some pips all right which is not bad um, you know the market is, is the thing about this trade here which is which is pretty interesting is that this is our area of support and that's where the market fell to before going back up so if you are if you are short if you're short on this on this pair right here, um, you might want to consider closing out. All right, don't stick around too long, and then have your profit taken away from you because you, you should be in profit had you taken the um, trade alert when it was given. All right, so you should be in profit. Um, nonetheless, you see there is a great pullback, just about 50 pips or so for the day but the day isn't over still still rather new New York session just opened up not long ago and so we have quite a few hours before uh, the day is complete so there's a lot to consider and whether or not your bias will change by the end of the day um, but nonetheless definitely consider um, the, the big picture you know you have to consider the big picture market being at support uh, great pullback depending on which way this candle closes will determine if you want to take the trade up or continue going down all right so this is all that I wanted to show you guys uh, definitely appreciate you guys um, messaging me and emailing me while I was out on vacation let me know hey I got in on the trade uh, thank you so much um, this is this is just what I what I love to do I love to give you guys little pointers because there are there are a lot of clues in the market that are left behind and it's up to you to notice them all right I happen to notice them and I can tell what the market is doing so if you uh, look at the market for what it is you too will be able to do that all right uh, just want to let you guys know um, you know for those of you who are brand new for those of you who are finding me for the first time I do offer forex training and uh, other products on my website. You can visit my site at www.sodarneasyforex.com. Welcome to you know poke around, see what see what might interest you. 
If you have any questions, you can email me at so darn easy forest at gmail.com or you can easily uh, call me at 929-274-0555. All right. Until next time, you guys, you guys have a great day and I definitely appreciate you guys messaging me, those of you who had took the opportunity to get on these three trailers. All right. Till next time. Peace.